Morning YouTube, it's early on a Saturday morning. Uh, this uh, particular bit of content was supposed to take place yesterday, Friday morning. I am currently at the 40-something annual Southwest Classics uh, swap meet in Arlington, Texas. Now, the reason this was supposed to happen on Friday, but I'm here on Saturday, is because if you're at all in tune with the news, you know that the um, Texas Rangers won the World Series. They had a parade here in this particular area because as you can see by this, in the very near distance there, you can see that's actually Global Life Park and Choctaw Stadium, which are the two uh, baseball fields in this area. The one in the closest foreground is Choctaw Stadium. That's the old ballpark and they're in the background. I don't know if you can see it or not. Let me see if I can zoom in is Global Life Park. That's where the uh, Texas Rangers play. Now the reason uh, I am here today instead of yesterday is because as I mentioned they had a parade. They were expecting around 250,000 people and as a result in this about roughly 25 to 30 block area they had 500,000 people show up. Uh, some people that I know at this swap meet told me don't bother because uh, even though they had the parking lot blocked off for this swap meet, the idiots, and yes I am using that word idiot, uh, that attended the parade were ignoring all of the traffic signs, ignoring cops, ignoring cones, and ignoring curbs and driving up over and saturating all the parking lots so there was no way you could get to the swap meet. So here I am Saturday morning. We're going to spend the, uh, the uh, morning walking around the uh, grounds, see if we can find anything good. Uh, and uh, then I'm probably going to depart for a visit to Summit Racing today to pick up some miscellaneous items. And then unfortunately it's off to a root canal. So yay, dental surgery on a weekend. Woohoo! Well, stay tuned. We got the, uh, going to take a look at the uh, swap meet right now. Is it, is it all closed up now? Oh, I, yeah, I see a few cars up front. Yeah, they're just, they got, they're just no, it's pretty well gone. Like, it's been closed for two years. Any years? Yeah, I just got it for the other one. Yeah, exactly. So you're like me now, you're retired. I'm, I'm out of it, I love it. Five. Now I get to come do all this stuff again like I really like. This is basically what Holly's truck started out as. Yes. 
68, but it's got a 70 through 72 grill. And it's got holes.
Well, impressions of the uh, swap meet are it's pretty decent swap meet. Lots of vendors for, for a smaller size swap meet. Uh, got to meet uh, a couple of really, really cool people. Uh, looking around a lot of stuff. I uh, met one gentleman in particular, and I'm going to uh, dig out his business card here so I can tell you exactly who he was. His, name, uh, he is, his YouTube channel is Willie Walks. Uh, of course, that looks backwards because of the camera I'm using, but it is what it is. He is uh, broadcasting live from the swap meet right now, and I got a chance to meet him, subscribe to his channel, so shout out to you, sir. Uh, nice meeting you. I um, departed early because uh, that swap meet has the same problem that typical swap meets of that size have, and that is, you know, many of you might like this uh it's not my thing that's 90 percent of the stuff is chevrolet stuff uh so i did find some ford stuff shot some footage of that uh, right now just to give you a little insight of what i'm doing is i'm scoping out uh doing the preliminary groundwork for my next project got a couple of ideas on what i want to work on next uh and add to the list of stuff that we're doing and i've got some other uh, decisions to make as well uh on that and and some other things I've got in the pipe that I'm not going to divulge right now. Right now, I am at the Arlington, Texas Summit Racing. Going to look around here, see if there's anything I can't live without. And then I'm going to head back home and get ready for the dreaded dental stuff. So uh, let's take a look around here, and then we'll head back home. I could spend my entire paycheck here every week. Well, that visit did yield some ideas. Unfortunately, uh, Summit has the same problem that every store has right now at the beginning of November is we're not yet geared up for the Christmas season, so they don't have a lot of their sales and don't have a lot of their items on the floor. In fact, their inventory is quite a bit lower than it has been in times past that I've noticed. So I will have to pay a visit back here again in a few weeks. But in the meantime, that's going to wrap this video. Be sure and stay tuned and hit subscribe. we got more stuff coming. Thanks.